Hey guys, Mitch here. Today we're going over the top 10 best city tweaks for the year 2012. Now this is part 12 of the series and it does contain tweaks from the months of September to November. So let's dive in. Our first city tweak is called Bridge. Now Bridge makes it possible to add any song or video to your media library without having to use of iTunes. Once you have your media type selected, I do recommend Safari Download Manager to actually download the file. You will be able to edit the contents of this, including the title, the artist, the album, the genre, even the album artwork. Once you have those edited, you can go ahead and preview and then import it to your music library on your device. And there you can easily go ahead and listen to the song on your device. Our next city tweak is called Mission Board Pro. Now this is the pro version to the pre-existing mission board and with it it is a switcher replacement on your device with some customization. If you go ahead and invoke it you will see a nice preview of each app running in the background of your device. Now you can edit some of the features including the paging if you want to add the badges and with these features enabled you will see that we do have the badges in the top right hand corner of each device and it will page nice and easily on your device. Our next city tweak is called Swipe Away. Now Swipe Away allows you to kill all the apps running in the background individually or as a whole. So normally if you wanted to delete one you would have to hold down, the red arrow will pop up. But now all you have to do is go ahead and swipe up on one of the apps and all the apps in the background will be deleted in a quick and efficient way. Our next city tweak is called Camera Tweak. Now this adds powerful enhancements to your iOS camera app on your device. First and foremost, you can unlock or lock the white balance by just selecting that option. And you can separately move the exposure point to the focal point or just click in the background and those two will be combined. Now you will have two modes which you can work in, either the normal mode or the advanced mode which will bring up those two focal points. And the first option here is the timer lapse. Now this will add pictures or take pictures every in this case three seconds so if you go ahead and select ok it will count down from three down to one and take a picture and then it will continually take pictures every three seconds now you will have a basic timer so if you would like to take a picture with the entire family you could easily set this up on a tripod count down for the number of seconds and it will take the seconds now you can add different grid lines in the background for the actual camera apps, you have those squiggly ones, the um, crosshairs and whatnot. Now this also works for the video camera modes. So you can change out the white balance, the exposure to the focal point, and you can edit out the frame rate down to about one second, up to about 60. In addition, we, de we do have the different um, settings here. So you can go 960 by 540, 720 by 720 or whatever. And we also have the little bars if you want to have the different aspect ratios, 16 by 9, 6 by 4, etc. Our next city tweak is called Scale. Now Scale allows you to share what you're listening to to the different social media networks. So clicking on the little button, you can have it shared to email, message, tweet, copy it, or you can add it to its own playlist. And if you go ahead and select it, it will bring up the message and say that you are listening to the song by whoever. Our next city tweak is called Now Now. Now this is a replacement if your device is unable to run Siri but uses Google Voice Search. Once you have an activation method enabled, you can go ahead and use that activation method and you can go ahead and speak now your questions. So if I ask what time is it, it will bring up a Google Voice Search asking me what time. Now this is just like a Siri um, search. You can ask it what will the weather be like today and it will bring up the weather forecast for the next 10 days. And this will also ask arithmetic questions. So you can ask it what is 2 plus 2 and instead of bringing up Wolfram Alpha it will bring up the calculator. Our next city tweak is called YouTube Opener. Now this will open up YouTube links with Google's new YouTube app. So in this case we have a YouTube link sent in by our iMessage here and if you go ahead and open it up it will automatically open up in the new YouTube app and there you can go ahead and view the new features that incorporate such as the commenting, the likes, the dislikes, and you can have the option to subscribe to iApple Tech 2. Our next city tweak is called No Cover Flow. Now normally when you tilt your device into the landscape mode when you are listening to a song it will bring up that cover flow option but what this tweak enabled that cover flow will not pop up but in essence, the screen will just tilt into landscape mode 
where you can edit out the volume, your play slash pause, and you can slide the track to the different points on the song that you are listening to. Our next CD tweak is called Smart 3G. Now this will enable or disable your connection whether you are on Wi-Fi or not on Wi-Fi. So right now I am running Wi-Fi on my device here. And if I head over to my Smart 3G settings, make sure that it is enabled. And if you go to your general and go into your network, you will take notice that the enable 3G in cellular data is turned off to save battery life. Now you will skip all the messages, uh, emails, phone calls like normally. If you head up to the Wi-Fi and you disable the Wi-Fi, automatically your cellular data and your enable 3G will pop up to save yourself battery life. Up next is Universal Video Downloader. Now this allows you to download an assortment of videos right from your device. Now this does include the YouTube videos, but it also will include nine YouTube videos. Once the video has popped up, you have this little pop-up message that will pop up. You can go ahead and click download and you can add a video name to the actual video and click download in the top right hand corner and it will be downloading in its own app and once completed you have the option to view the video as an offline off your cellular data saving yourself some network usage. Our next city tweak is called S-Lite Enhancer Search. Now this allows you to enhance the spotlight search on your device. So in the settings here, we have the option to search from both Cydia, Google, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, uh, Twitter. Now you must have those apps downloaded and then click the apply changes down below. Now if you head over to the spotlight here and we search for the City Tweak Bridge, it will bring up the default bridge as the app and search the web. But now we have the option to search within Cydia, Facebook, Google, Twitter. And if you go ahead and select the search within Cydia here, it will bring up the Cydia here, and there we have bridge right there in the text field. So guys, this has been a look at the top 10 best Cydia tweaks for the year 2012, and this is part 12 of the series. If any of these tweaks did go fast, I will have links in the description below, which will give you a more in-depth look at each of the video. If you guys do like these videos, don't forget to give a like up, leave any comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to stay updated. Thanks guys.